Trust is hardwired into the brain. We are hardwired to trust people. We are social beings. You know, trust develops over the first few months of our lives. When you trust someone, it releases a chemical from your hypothalamus called oxytocin, which is a feel-good chemical. It's the trust love drug in a way. And the hypothalamus, when releasing oxytocin, uh, the oxytocin actually dampens the effects from the amygdala, which is the alarm system of the brain. So when you feel that sense of trust with a lover in bed, you forget temporarily about the dangers out in the world or the possibility that you're gonna die one day. Instead, you find the bliss, the saturated oxytocin high that you get from this trust chemical. However, we also know from watching brain games that we can't always trust our senses out in the world. You know, our senses only can process limited information. Our brain receives that limited information and fills in the blanks. It makes inferences about the world at any given time. It's kind of a game that we're playing at every given moment and deciding what's real and what isn't. I guess we can never really know.